Hey guys, so let's talk about what just happened last night. I'm making this Sunday night, but it'll be uploaded Monday. Essentially, all of the expeditions as well as the mythics. So I'm kind of surprised the mythics were released be because normally what they do is they give the mythics to, you know, a Channel Fireball or a Star City Games. They give the mythics to various people to go ahead and disclose, right? Even something that we already knew, like the filter lands, it's still very nice. And definitely Wasteland as a expedition would have been epic to whoever was able, and it could even be Wizards of the Coast themselves. Essentially, so a lot of you know I work in marketing. Essentially, this tanks any marketing campaign because instead of building up excitement, building up excitement, imagine Wasteland. What a waste of an opportunity. But each of these cards are is a potential possibility of building relationships with uh, content creators, uh, building relationships with the people who play Magic and buy Magic products. Uh, and now it's kind of a waste. I don't know exactly what happened, but this is on the epic scale. This is pretty close to when new phyrexia the god book was released uh, essentially somebody took pictures of each of these cards and posted them on reddit and that is the end of that um essentially uh it's probably one of the crazier things i've seen uh recently uh given the fact of how many of these cards could have been um given to someone else and now it's not the not possible i mean the whole mythic whole expedition they're all right here and there's no i mean it's not like no everyone has access to finding what they are now i think something like chandra and then this the two planeswalkers especially uh seem like such a waste but i do like when information gets out there and it's not kind of hidden behind you know oh well you done this for us we'll give it to you so a lot of interesting speculations can be made from uh, this particular batch of and it's it's so crazy to me that the mythics like i get the expeditions and to a lesser extent expeditions are not as important i believe as the mythics when you come down to it but now what are you going to do for oath of the gate watts like how many rares or uncommons are actually going to be worth looking at when you have all the mythics and expeditions right here uh, you even have the land. You have the enemy land, the red, white enemy enemy land. Um, I'm assuming it produces a two one double strike type of creature, which is very good. Um, I definitely don't want to take away from that. That's actually very good in this particular deck. But I don't. And, and the other card that I saw that was, and you have uncommons. You, I mean, you have a lot being spoiled here. That. Uh, what is Wizard of the Coast going to do later when it does get to Dece end of December, uh, January, and it's time to kind of go over these cards when they've all been spoiled already on by someone, some some random person on Reddit. I'm assuming it's a printer, and it's got to be a printer who has access to uh, probably most importantly the expeditions, and that can't be that many of them. And here we have Geist. I mean, I think this is Geist. I don't know. I don't read this language, but it's uh, Japanese. If it, It's a 2-2 two -two that produces a 4-4. Four -four. I don't know. And you got Angels in the background. I don't know too many other cards. And that would have been an epic. So beyond the fact that the cards were released early, I don't really know what to make out of it. Um, is it good for the game? Is it bad for the game? Leave a comment below because I feel like one hand... You know, people have want information. People always want more information, and it's nice that people get information. Um, but on the other hand, I can see this from a marketing perspective being an absolute disaster. Um, again, you probably are going to give these to people, and they're going to do a YouTube video or a article on it, and people are not going to be like, oh, well, that was surprising, that's awesome. And they're not going to be able to drive traffic. Um, again, if you're the first one talking about any of these cards, you're going to drive a lot of traffic to your website, your YouTube channel, whatever, your uh, your podcast. But if uh, if everyone already knows what they are, um, 
that's kind of the end of that. So I don't know. Um, I think it's kind of a bad. I don't see this being too good. I just know that someone's going to lose their job probably Monday.